Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kola Ole Alice Olavisi, and this is Betchama Betpreneur, otherwise known as Pencil and Eraser Channel. It is becoming an equivalent task to get a good worker, to get a good employee. We've had instances of people disappearing with company's car, company's money. You hire some people and what they are thinking is how to defraud the company. They want to make more money than their employer. They want to circumvent the system. So in this video, I'll be talking about how to be a good employee. Many people are going into a company, a business, an enterprise they know little or nothing about. But there are standards, there are things that are required of us too. So some are just going there, maybe you, you went to school, you have an excellent grade and because of that people are looking for you. What does he require to be a good employee? Let me say this, a good employee is someone that the management can trust to do some work. It's that has something to do with your qualification, your age. See, people have hired people that are highly qualified, more than qualified for a certain job. And at the end of the day, they fuck up big time. They have the all the knowledge about how things should be done, but in practical terms, they have not done it before. They have all the knowledge and they have not done anything even to hone their skill. That employee, that the management, the proprietor of a business can simply commit some work into is a good employee. And what are the qualities or what makes one a good employee? A good employee eh, adhere to companies policy and guidelines you may have your own method of doing things you may have your own method of you know of going about an issue but you maintain you follow the company's aims and objectives their mission and their vision if you are going to you know suggest to them anything that may be in the management meeting. We will have a meeting. And we're gonna it's just like a football player. Your coach, you know, substituted you know somebody for you and I said, okay, go into that field, go and do so 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 and so. You see that uh, number nine, tackle him, don't allow don't give him a breathing space. And when your you she gets to the field, you know, is pursuing how to score. He has fucked up big time. So the same thing with an employee. You must work with the company rules and regulations. Every company, every business, you know, uh, has their own guidelines. What they set to achieve, you must work within the ambit, within, within the precept of the company's rules and regulations. Then a good employee is someone who treats everybody with respect. Not someone that will see you and you know, people that are paying eye service. No, they treat everybody with respect from the gate man to the general manager. You don't look down on anybody. See, that man you are looking today as a gate man, he rise to become anything tomorrow. So you treat everybody with respect. Your colleagues, even those that, that are opposed to you. You treat them with respect. You treat your, your your superiors with respect. Even if you are older than them. You don't say, don't you know my age? Uh, I'm supposed to be this, so, so, so. I've worked in so, so, so place. Then, why don't you stay there? You treat everybody with respect. It's a good employee put in their best. They are not lackadaisical. They are fear in their approach to work. They put in their best. They want the best for the company. 
you see, you employ some people after uh, uh, my friend told me sometimes he goes, say this my uh, this my brother. I look, you know, when I it was funny, and I said, okay, let me get something for him in my company. They gave him some product. Oh God, this guy will dump the product somewhere. The guy will tell you, uh, I'm going, you know, to to talk to people about this. But this guy will go and go. At the end of the month, this guy failed to meet target. He refused to meet target like three, four times. It was the lady that was helping him to, you know, to cover up, to cover up. When they got to a stage, the lady couldn't bear it again. It's not supposed to be. You have to put in your best, even if that is not your dream job that you are seen in that place. Do whatever you can do. Don't, don't, don't be lazy about it. Don't be lackadaisical. Have this approach or attitude that whether they like it or not, I'm going to get my salary at the end of the month. Why you may get your salary? But in your conscience, you want that salary? You want what you are getting at the end of the month? Do certain things you do in a wishy washy way, do it anyhow. If it to be your business, will you have done it that way? They put in your best. A good employee put in their best. From there, you may have a recommendation for a better job. Somebody will just ask you, do you know so 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 person? What can you tell me about the, the person? I said, ah, that one is excellent. I've, I've had people that work with me that any day, any time, they knock at my door, I need a recommendation, I need this, I will gladly do it. You don't know tomorrow what may happen. person may go and say, come, I'm traveling. I hand over this business to you, run it. As an employee that have been assigned a specific duty, you must learn about that position. You must learn about the position. You know, education makes you versatile. Education makes you a utility player. So learn about the, the position, your new position. What it requires, the job function. Look at the job function. Help the company. In this age of smartphone and uh, internet this or that, you can Google. Come up with something for the company. Ah, sir, ma, look at this that I discovered so 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 place. Maybe they are into manufacturing or they are into OCs. Ah, I discovered so 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 in India. There is a company in, uh, in uh, Pakistan. There is a company in Germany that is into production of so 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 so. Can we contact them? Can we do this? Can we do that? Learn about the position. Don't be lazy. A good employee is a utility player. See, you are helping this, you are helping, you are helping yourself. Somebody said, I am a millionaire because I help people in my niche to become a millionaire. Don't say yes, the world does not revolve around you alone. Build other people. Be a utility player. When it is time for you to defend, defend, rush to the defense to defend your team. When it's time to play your role as a midfielder, play your role as a midfielder. Then if you have opportunity to score as a striker, do so. Help them. Even if you're a striker and you know your position is not very good, you know, to score, you can give it to somebody that is very close. Help yourself, help others. Help others achieve their target. Whether you are becoming an, an utility player, don't just Say, you no, know, once I make my target, that's all. I don't care about anybody. No. Somebody you look down on today may be your saving grace tomorrow. Something can happen to you. They will say, ah, that guy, no, 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 that guy is not like that. We have to help him out. That's happened to many people before that. No. We are still talking about being a good employee. Let's go to another point. Another point is be a critical thinker. And solution provider a critical thinker and solution provider there is no body that will be a critical thinker and solution provider that company will allow to go easily they want to keep you no my friend got married uh, we need a week you know they call him oh come on please oh, we have issue here i said no but you guys gave me one month i ah, said please oh, that one month anything you come with we are going to pay you handsomely is it? Be a critical thinker. Don't just limit yourself to a position. If you are employed as a secretary, not maybe to write or take minutes, learn about 
the desktop publishing. Learn about graphics. Learn about things that will enhance your business or your job. Provide solution. They are thinking about this. How do we do it? Just come up with an idea. A lady that was employed as, a, as an auxiliary rep, but he saw something, you know, that got, uh, that was wrong with one of the product of the company. This lady took the product, kept it in her bag. Then it was time for her to talk. He said, "Sir, uh, with all the respect, sir, I have an observation." He said, "Okay, okay, okay what?" She brought out the drug. She said, "Look at this product. Uh, this child on this product." You know, has been used in by another pharmaceutical uh, company. So, so the, the man said, Ooh, wow. And the minute the man, the, 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 the company said, Please, who are you? He said, I'm an auxiliary rev. I said, You are not supposed to be an auxiliary rev. Immediately, they confirmed her appointment. Immediately. He said, No, you are not supposed. Even people that have been here for years cannot see this mistake. They did not see it. But you, you are just working, you are not even up to three months. No, you are the type of people I want in my company. And that is how she got the job. Be a critical thinker. Look at things around you, things you know should, you know should be faced. Don't tell people, I don't care. A good employee takes responsibility for their errors. Don't pass the buck. Don't say, no, 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 no. Hey, it's this guy that's supposed to do this, that, this. No. You are wrong, admit. The another one is maintain a superb relationship with your superior, with your boss, with the owner of the company, with your uh, colleague, with everybody. A superb relationship. Good interpersonal relationship. <laughs> maintain a good interpersonal relationship with your boss, with your superior with your colleague and with the people below you so somebody that you think even your driver your driver you know, say, ah, uh, okay. I saw so, 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 you know, but I think I know somebody in that place ok let's go and try that one may just lift you up at ah, this man you have something else I will still retain you as my driver a good employee maintains good relationship with everybody in the company. Okay, this one is also important. Develop a good skill. Communication skill. Everything. You know how to talk to people. Your your boss, your superior, your the people under you. Even your customers. Develop a good skill. Learn about it. So now I've gotten this job. Ah, it's time for me to rest. No! The world is changing, evolving. Don't, 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 don't just sit down. Develop skills that will help you. I've been trusted you know, with a position. Do well to develop skills that will help that position. So what I mean is don't be a liability. To the company, don't be a liability. Develop skills as I'm doing it. Go for online courses. Oh, the world is changing. You know, you know that just a picture may convey more than what you say in 10 minutes. You are employed to work, do something else that will enhance your productivity. Don't just be a liability to the company. This one is also very important. See, if there is a reward system in place in that employment, in that enterprise, in that company, motivate yourself to be the best, to win the award, not by doing eye service, no. But for instance, maybe you work in bank, or this thing, and you're somebody in the staff of the month, you know, understanding the person, know what this person is doing differently. I'm not, I'm not talking about on healthy rivalry. No. But think of what you can bring to the table. What does what does it take for somebody to win an award in this in this area? What does it take to be the best in social organization? 
work on yourself and gradually. I've seen people, they, especially these tennis players, that you see them when they get to quarter final in, in this competition. The next one, they get to semi final. The next one, they get to final. And before you know, they win. But they are developing themselves. And before you know, they become world number one, world number two. It does, it's not just, you don't just get to one number one by being a mediocre. Whatever you do, just try to be the best. You don't sell pepper. You use, are you employed to sell in a grocery shop? Are you employed to sell in a pharmaceutical shop? Are you employed as a nurse? Are you employed as be the best? Let people around you, you know, be a reference point. Let them know you. Be a reference point. I, I know of a lady a very long time ago. This girl was just she was training as an auxiliary nurse. But everybody knows that this is her quality. Even the owner of the hospital sponsor her to, to go to school of nursing. The way this lady will take care of babies, oh my god, it's out of this world. Even people that have BSc nursing, that have, uh, that have gone to school of nursing, uh, uh, they can't do half of this lady was doing. And everybody, even the patients, any day this lady is not on duty, oh god, people will start asking, where is a nurse And the MD of the company, look at that, this lady, this talent was not just waste. He sponsored her education. Say, lady, you have to go to the school of nursing. And today, I know the lady will be, will be making waste wherever she is. She, 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 she has it in her life. So it is very important to be a utility player, develop yourself and uh, uh, strive to be the best wherever you are. And don't forget to uh, watch my videos, I have so many of them there, watch my videos, like them, share them, share them on your on your platforms, share them, let people see it, don't be selfish. Then importantly, please subscribe to my channel, then hit the bell notification to know when I drop the uh, next video. So thank you very much for coming. I love you. Uh, you are the reason I'm here. Without you, I wouldn't be there. But uh, perhaps you have something to tell me. Use the comment section for the video you want us to to do. You have the uh, important thing you want us to talk about. If you have any questions? Please ask. You are learning.